I gotta lay off the nuggets. I'm not a chicken, I'm Twitter. Twitter's not yellow. I'm here via TweetDeck. Awesome. Some people get stalked on Twitter. I get stalked by Twitter. Listen, at Danny Rocks. Just Danny. Out here in reality, or wherever this is. Your followers are worried. You're not sending any tweets. You're not even answering your DMs, which is a major social media faux pas, by the way. I wonder what would happen if I stuck my iPhone in this thing. You were on a trajectory like this. Your cloud score is soaring. You're going to have 500 followers before you know it. We had a... We had a baby. That seems tweet worthy. My real friends know we had a baby. Your tweets, 10 May. Headed to the hospital. More tweets and pics to come. That was three weeks ago. Classic tweet tease. Look, Twitter, can't we just call it paternity leave? I mean, a day, a week. I'll get back to it, okay? But you're missing some prime stuff here. Tweet every feeding. Tweet every dirty diaper. Followers eat that sort of stuff up. I don't need to validate my fatherhood experience on Twitter. Would you make an excellent tweet, by the way? Think of me as your digital baby book, a repository for all these sweet and tender moments that you're having with your baby. So you're committed to archiving my tweets for my lifetime and the lifetime of my child. Oh, sorry about that little downtime. Did you say something? Can I just take a break? This is a new gig. I'm not sure what I want to share, what I want to keep for myself. So this is done. I gotta go take care of the baby. You'll need me to express how you feel about it. My love for my son seems greater than 140 characters. See? You're a natural. Uh, eh, just wait till Facebook gets a hold of him.